Sister Spade here. Don't touch that dial. Stay a while. So we're all here today to learn together how we can all become one of the companions of the living Imam, as we have been over the few weeks gathering our tools to do so. But how do we become one of the companions of the living Imam? May Allah hasten his reappearance. And what does it mean to have the qualities? If you want to be one of the companions of the living Imam, may Allah hasten his reappearance in his army, which means either his soldier, and if you dare go a little bit further with more discipline, one of the commanders, then you're gonna have to have two things, knowledge and obedience. But what does that mean? The companions and the commanders of the living Imam have a very deep knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the living Imam. May Allah hasten his reappearance. Not only that, but they also have an attitude of obedience. When seeking knowledge from the Quran about Allah, the ahl bayt and the living Imam, may Allah hasten his reappearance. In order to reach obedience, we have to have an attitude that leads us to obedience. In other words, we can go to the Holy Quran and just recite it because we know that that's our duty or because we know that we get a lot of barakat for it or we can go towards the Quran in order to extract guidance for our duties. This attitude of seeking guidance towards being told by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala what to do in order to achieve his satisfaction will guide us towards obeying the living Imam. May Allah hasten his reappearance. Imam Ali alayhi salam said about the companions of Imam Zaman, may Allah hasten his reappearance, that the companions of the living Imam, may Allah hasten his reappearance, have sound knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In addition to having this sound knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the companions of the living Imam, may Allah hasten his reappearance, also have a very profound, deep and heartfelt knowledge and connection to their living Imam, so that it becomes the vehicle and motivation and inspiration for everything they do in life. So after we have understood the right of the living Imam, may Allah hasten his reappearance to Wilayat, and his right to authority, now the journey really begins. Because ultimately, we need to realize, we need to really ingrain it deep down inside there, that the word of the Imam is none other than the word of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And once we recognize that, we then begin to live our life seeking the words of the living Imam because we realize that that is what we are here for, to bring on and hasten the reappearance of our living Imam. May Allah hasten his reappearance. Now the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him in his household, said that the companions of the living Imam May Allah hasten his reappearance, try their utmost best to do everything to obey the living Imam. So perhaps we can shift our attitude just a little bit to change it to make sure that we know that we are doing everything to obey the living Imam. May Allah hasten his reappearance. Glad you stayed. Sister Spade.